Hi, this is Sheriff Veronica, and no one in my chat understands what's happening with the snap elections, okay? No one. Okay, so we, what we are hearing is 17, 17 members of Mia Motley's BLP party were about to go to the president of Barbados, the Republic of Barbados, to have Mia Motley thrown under the bus. That's what we're hearing. And when Mia Motley heard what was about to happen to her, she dissolved parliament. Mia Motley dissolved parliament. 17 members were about to throw her under the bus, no confidence. They have no confidence in Mia Motley. They were about to throw her under the bus and Mia Motley dissolved parliament. Now, Mia Motley showed up today with 30 members, 30 members of the BLP to contend in the next elections, okay? Elections are called for January 19, 2022. And Mia Motley showed up prepared with the 17 who wanted to throw her under the bus. She showed up today prepared to contend in the next general elections. Now my question is, is everything forgiven? Is she no longer bad for the country? Is there no longer a vote of no confidence? What happened between her dissolving parliament and showing up at the registry today to register to become a new government? And if Mia Motley wins on November 19, 2022, if she wins, if she wins on, did I say January, January 19th of next year, 2022, if Mia Motley wins that next election, are the 17 who wanted her gone, are they satisfied? Is everything that they were worried about and they were complaining about before, is that all null and void? They have no problem with her anymore. Everything is copacetic. They are bosom pals. They are kissing buddies. What does it mean? What does it mean? No one, no one in the chat knows what it means. Or if it was a ploy of the DLP, maybe they, they, they started the rumor. But the rumor, the rumor is 17 members of the Mia Motley coalition, well, not a coalition, the Mia Motley party, the BLP, Mia Motley is the head. 17 members of that party wanted her gone. She called snap elections for January 19th, 2022. She showed up today with 30 full members, 30 full members. We want to know after she wins, if she wins, Will everything be forgiven? Is she no longer a no confidence vote in their mind? What happened? What happened between then and what will happen between January 19th, 2022 that makes them okay with the whole situation? That's a question that is unanswered up to this day in my group. No one knows. It's Sheriff Veronica. Subscribe, subscribe, like, comment, share, and educate.